Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've got an unbagging um, and these are three paintings from the Goddess of Luck store on AliExpress. And they're actually a poured glue. I have got a lot of double-sided tape canvases and I really wanted some poured glue um, just to give me a break. I do find double-sided tape um, because my eyesight is not brilliant, I do find it harder to work on and I do prefer the uh, poured glue. So let's have a look at these. Let's get them out of the packets. I have three paintings. Okay. Oh, and we've got oh, just a, a little thing that they've started doing. Just got a little look bracelet. I do believe that red is for good luck. But that's a nice little touch. Thank you very much. Uh, the Goddess of Luck store. Okay. So we have three paintings. As I say, all poured glue. They are only small ones. It actually looks as though these are partials, though. Um, I've paid roughly about £3 each for them. Yeah, that one's a partial as well. So let's have a look at this one first. This one's the nearest to us. Them out of the packets. They are only small ones. But I do like doing uh, a smaller canvas sometimes. Just gives you a break if you're doing something a bit more uh, big or if you've got a bit more big. That's not good English, is it? something a bit larger or a bit uh, more involved shall we say um so yeah so this one is a lovely little westy um a west highland white terrier look at that little face we used to have um a little west highland white terrier before we had scotty dogs um, watch my channel for a while you'll know that i do have uh, millie our little scottish terrier so she is a cousin of the west highland white terrier and the west highland white terriers were bred to be white because i do believe um one of the scottish gentlemen that went hunting with the dogs um actually shot one of his dogs by mistake because he couldn't see it so they bred the Westies, the, the white dog, so that they could see them better when they were uh, ratting or getting the birds or whatever they do when they're hunting. Sorry, I don't really know much about hunting. Um, and Westies and Scotties do have an extra couple of vertebrae in the tails so that they could be pulled out um, by the tails if they got stuck in a burrow. It's um, something that was bred into them. So just a few facts about West Highland White Terriers there. Um, but yeah, so this is a say a partial, which means that the background isn't diamond painted, it is just the little pup that is diamond painted there. So it won't be many colours this one, let me see. It's uh, 10 colours and it's a very good drill field and they're all uh, numbers and capital letters, so really easy to see. Nice clear drill field. And this one will go in the folder and get put under something flat to straighten it out. Um, oh, we've got a step up from a basic toolkit. So let's have a look. We've got what's that? Is that a six placer possibly? Let me have a look on my card. Or is it a seven? that's a seven placer so I've not got one of those on there so I'll have to when I get a spare one I'll be able to put my seven on there so that's a seven placer put that one out there and then we've got quite a few of your little grip seal bags which is great there's probably ten there so you'll be able to put your drills in as you're going through uh, sadly there's no DMC numbers on there uh, that's the opaque sort of pinky wax which isn't the best wax but it will do the job and as it's only a small painting so it's enough to get you started nice little kits these for anybody that's just wanting to start out because there's not a huge amount to do um and you know you, you can get to see whether you like it or not and again not a very expensive uh, kit to do let's see if there's any dmc codes on these drills let's have a look what have we got on here? Gosh, that's really, really pale there. I do think that that may be DMC codes, but to be honest, it's, it says 
seven two two yeah i do think that they're dmc codes but they're not very easy to make out yeah that's five two hundred for the whites so yeah it has got them on the drills but they're very very thin very rubbed i don't know if you can quite see that they're not the easiest thing to make out uh, i have got my new magnifying glass though so possibly i will be able to see so let's have a look then so we have that one's definitely 310 uh, that looks like this is 3045 3787 427 721 so we know that that one's the b5200 which is great uh, 738 or 736, not sure which. 739, 717, and is that 167 possibly? They do look sort of plasticky, the drills. They don't look like the resin. I think these are acrylic. Um, they don't look very faceted. I'm sure they will look lovely when they're all done and I will show you the picture when it's done so that's number one okay, I don't like that one I like that, I like that picture and then this one is another cutie and let's see where's the end on this one again a partial so it looks as though possibly the poured glue ones do actually come partial rather than full drill which is a shame Anyway, we'll see. I shall continue my hunt for hard glue on uh, AliExpress. Okay. And this one is a little hedgehog. And again, a lovely little cutie. 30 by 30. Uh, same toolkit. Only this one hasn't got a multiplacer with it. No, no multiplacer in there. So that's strange. So we've got a multiplacer with the last one. I haven't got one with this one. Okay, and that looks like it's a red piece of wax and a few less of your little grip seal bags. Okay. Oh, they feel a bit dusty. There's like a, a coating of dust on those. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, look. My hands are dirty now. Just a minute. Let me just grab something to wash my hands. Right, I'm back. Although they're probably going to get dirty again, picking it up again. I don't want to take my canvases. So again, it's a partial which means that it is just a hedgehog. It's a shame that the apples aren't uh, diamond painted, but it is just the hedgehog around the edges there. Okay, but it's got a very cute little face. This one's only eight colours. But again, nice, clear drill field. Look at that little face. Could you just squeeze that little nose? Oh. And, yep, they're all numbers. And my favourites, one, two, three, four down to eight are all the same number as they are on the canvas it's something that my brain just can't compute when you get number six as number seven and number one as number eight uh, i just i just end up putting them on the wrong place so <laughs> i'm easily confused so that's your little head job let's have a look at these drills then looks like they're the same drills so there's no dmc code on the canvas but there are on the drills and what i might do is write them um, next to the canvas uh, once I've, because uh, I will photocopy this and kit this up. Uh, well, I might not kit this up because there's not many to do. I'll see how it goes. I'll let you know. That packet is really, really good. Babe. Oh, these are okay inside though. These are clean. There's no, 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 there is a bit of dirt on there. Mm, hope the drills are okay then. So, ah, now these are a lot clearer to read. So we've got 3371 there, 801 I think, 434, 436, 739, 318, 415 and 762. So they're a lot clearer. The other packet, as I say, does just look a little bit rubbed. Okay, so that's that one. That's really cute. Again, they don't look the best quality drills. Um, but yeah, they're going to look good when they're done. But these are such cute little pictures. And again, for the price I've paid, then they're okay. Right, and then finally, this 
one. What did they call this one? Let have a look at my sheet. Oh, this one is just called a character landscape. Very strange, but I just thought it was really, really pretty. Okay, these are my late night uh, sort of like shopping sessions. Well, they're supposed to be perusing looking sessions, but I end up um, usually finding something and it goes in my basket and then I think, oh, well, I'll just add that in. And uh, yeah, so I didn't know this was partial. I did expect this to be a full drill. Um, but uh, yeah, it is literally just the tree that is going to be diamond painted in this one. Let me just bring that across a little bit more so you can see it better. The bottom is very, very pretty. It's printed flowers. It's like, not heather, but like all wild flowers. They're like um, really pretty weeds with flowers on. Uh, and then you've got your sunset over your background there. And then we've got, it looks like it's probably a pink blossom tree here, which is really, really pretty there. And this one is 13 uh, colours. Nice clear drill field there again and not quite such clear numbers there but it does look like they are all numbers and uh, letters i think it's just that the key code's not quite as big but yeah so they're all easy to read okay and the toolkit oh heck <laughs> looks like there's what one two there's three grip seal bags in there one little piece of wax and one pen so the first one had the multiplacer and the rest haven't got any, so that's strange, but hey ho. And then these, there's again no DMC codes on there and it doesn't look like, oh dear, there's no DMC codes on the drills either. So that's a shame as well. But I am keeping my drills that don't have DMC codes on because they are going into uh, my sort of like just colour order ones that uh, I'm doing for my stamps. Um, I've got some stamps that you stamp out and they've got the marks on them um, all printed out ready for putting your drills on. Okay, I have got um, a video with those on as well if you want to see that. So we've got lovely um, burgundies, pinky purples, going right the way through the spectrum of pinks and lilacs. And then coming up to reds through to oranges so that is really really definite sort of sunset nice summery hot summer days i think that reminds you of with pinks and oranges and purpley colors all oh, right let's just do a quick measure of these and now we've got them all out okay so this one is supposed to be 30 by 40 as with um, poured glue you tend to find that it will be yeah 35 that way by just over 24 you tend to lose about five centimeters um for the edges on these and then we'll just measure this one so this one is just 24 and a half centimeters by 25 centimetres, so not quite square that one. Let's have a look at this one. And this one is roughly 25 centimetres by 24 and a bit centimetres. So yeah, they're, they're roughly what it says, um, but you do tend to find that with poured glue that they're not quite the size. I'm gonna label these up, so I will uh, leave you for now and get them labelled up and put away and um, I hope you've enjoyed seeing these I certainly uh, will let you see them when I've got them all worked up and done so thanks for stopping by and um, if you've enjoyed it please press the like button and if you want to see what I get up to next and when these are completed if you press subscribe and come along and join us and um, then you will be notified when my next videos come up so thanks for stopping by hope to see you all again soon Bye for now.